Hi everyone, welcome to class. Um, uh, I'm laughing because this is probably the 10th take that I've taken just to intro this class, but I wanted to make sure that there's some part that I'm doing to give back uh, for all of you on here. And here's one of hopefully a few more free videos for you just to start uh, during these really extraordinary times. So my wish is that whoever watches this, you're doing well, you're doing all right, and that this helps you in some way, shape or form. But this class is all for you and about you. And as you can see, this is a blanket. So we're doing a yin class today. And if you're used to taking my classes, which are typically quite powerful and movement based, and this is what I really love, I also fully and wholeheartedly enjoy slowing things down to get a bit more, you know, centered in tune to, to me and what I'm doing. And so this is my gift to you today. So please enjoy, take your time. If you've never done this and you're gonna try it, good luck. No, it's, uh, it will be good. It just is gonna take some time to get used to possibly. There will be a lot of silence, so slow down and we hold the poses for one to five minutes it's not like an athletic stretch let yourself just ease into the way okay with that being said let's begin we're going to start with a little bit of breathing so find a nice seat sit up tall close the eyes if you need to roll your shoulders up and back or move your neck around for a moment please feel free to do so and start to tune into your breathing as if you can hear the inhale and hear the exhale. So what we're going to do to start is a little bit of breath retention. Feel free to have your eyes closed. You'll still be able to hear and understand what I'm saying. If you need them open, open them, but I challenge you to close them. So what we'll do is we'll take an inhale for a certain count. We'll hold the inhale, then we'll exhale for a count and hold the exhale. And I'll guide you through a few of these. So first things first, take a big breath in, all the way. Big breath out through your mouth. One more big breath in, all the way in. And then one more big breath out. Okay. And take an inhale for the count of one, two, three, four, five, and hold for one, two, three, four, five. Exhale everything out for five, four, three, two, one. Hold for five, four. Stay with it, three, two, one, begin again, inhale fully, one, and deeply. Two, three, four, five, hold. One, two, three, four, keep your neck relaxed, five. Exhale for five, four, three, two, one, hold, five, four, stay with it, three, two, one, inhale all the way for one, two, three, four, five, hold for one, two, three, four, Five. Exhale for five, four, three, two, one. Hold for one, two, three, four, five. Last one. Inhale one deeply, all the way. Two, three, four, five. Hold for one, two, three, four, five. Exhale for five, four, three, two, 
one and hold for one, two, stay three, four, five. Back to normal breathing, keep your eyes closed, sit still. And just observe you, the way you feel, where your mind is, where your body is. One moment of silence just for you. Gently begin to bring your attention back to this room and slowly begin to open your eyes, gazing slightly down at the ground or a little bit forward, and just stay focused. And then from here, we're going to come into our first pose of class. So now you can watch the video again. We're going to bring the soles of our feet together and do a, a butterfly pose, hold. If you want, I'm not focused on alignment, not in these classes with yin, but you can open up the balls of your feet should you choose. And then you have a few options. You can bring your hands onto the tops of the feet and come down. Okay, if you have limited flexibility, I don't have props here, but you can take a huge pillow or a couple of pillows and put them on top of you or in front of you and do one of these. Okay, or bring the feet a bit further away from you. Bring your hands underneath your shins. We're going to hold this about two minutes or close to 20 breaths. Okay, so once you're ready, relax your head towards the ground. Come back to your normal breathing and observe. Enjoy. And should you choose, you can just begin to watch and observe what you're feeling. You can also just breathe. But if you'd like to observe what you're feeling, you can check in with the physical sensations so what do you feel in your body right now? What is actually being activated or stressed or released? Stretched rather than stressed. Or what's your emotional space in this pose? And take your time. Keep coming back to your breath. We're more than halfway there. If you feel like your body is beginning to open up, you can try to go a little bit deeper by moving your feet further, or bringing your knees down a little bit more, or your upper body. Feel free to also stay. And then if any type of feelings that you have come up that are really intense, feel free to check in with them, to let them go and to try to move away from them. Or feel free to transform them and change them to something better. Okay? Or if you want to stay more in the meditative space, just come back to inhale and exhale. Let go of your mind completely. Take one more inhale and one more exhale. And then on your next inhale, slowly begin to come out of this pose. Not fast, 
This is about slowing down. So if you're someone that's this type A personality, boom, 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 slow down. Extend the legs forwards, okay? Walk your hands back behind you. You can lift your chest. Or if you want to do any other type of poses as a counter pose, so as a pose to do after this, please feel free. Otherwise, roll your shoulders back, lift your chest, breathe. When you come back to center, we'll do a little bit of laying down poses and I'm gonna give you a shortened version today, but um, first off, let's do a twist, okay? Soft twist, also around one to two minutes. So seated position, bring your left hand onto your right thigh and bring your right arm back behind you, okay? You don't have to have this perfect posture, this is just a yin class. So it's find a space where you can hold and you can breathe. The chin can be slightly tucked, and the spine can even be a little bit rounded, okay? Feel free to close the eyes and begin. feel like you'd like a little more twist as well, you can take that here now as well. More than halfway there. And pay attention to your breath. Okay, one more inhale. One more exhale. And then slowly make your way back towards center. If you need to take any counter poses, like I said, please feel free. Roll the neck around, the shoulders around, take your position. Or even sit still and stay with the like subtle energy of the pose. Okay. Just another tidbit, so I am talking quite a lot. I typically don't speak so much in these classes but I wanna give you as much information as possible. Within these poses, if you feel that your mind is just going insane, feel free to breathe deeper. So an inhale through the nose and a big exhale. I'm okay with that. This is your practice. Let's move to the other side, okay? Take an inhale, and as you exhale, bring your right hand on the left thigh, your left arm back behind you. You don't need to try to push and twist. Let yourself relax into the pose begin. We're at that point where you can go a little bit deeper now. And keep your breath. Focus on it. Take one more inhale, and one more exhale, and then slowly make your way back towards center. Okay. Feel free to sit still, or take any pose that you need, just for a moment.
sit with the silence. Okay, we're going to come into another forward fold. So extend your legs forwards. Make sure that you're sitting on your sit bones if you'd like. Okay, if you have a hard time with forward folds, again, put, if you have a block, put it underneath your butt or pillow. Okay, I'm pointing over to pillows over here because I see them, could have used them. And same thing here, you can put pillows in front of you and really hug them and relax. This is also going to be a couple of minutes long. Take your time. It is not about touching your toes. Okay? Take your inhale. And as you exhale, dive forward. Feel free to begin. Let your entire body, uh, fancy word, succumb to the pose. Let it surrender. Let it relax. Slow down. Calm down. Enjoy. And a question you can ask yourself again is, what do you feel? Where do you feel what you're feeling? And what information is this giving you? Do you want to move forward with it or let it go? Or shall you just come back to breath? More than halfway there. If you want to go a little bit more forward, you can. If the body says no, stay where you are. Take one more inhale, nice and slowly. And one more exhale. And then slowly begin to bring yourself all the way back up. Slow down. Right. And you can also walk your hands back behind you when you get there and lift your chest. And drop your head back, remove your neck and shoulders around. Feel free to take as deep of a breath as you need. Okay. From here, we're going to come back towards center. I'll turn sideways for you for this one. 
We're gonna lay it down, just do a, about three more poses total. So bring the soles of your feet together, bring your hands to the backs of your legs, and slowly lower yourself down towards the back of your mat, okay? If you need, and this is hard for you, again, uh, pillows or blocks underneath the knees around here will be helpful for you. And then slowly from here, bring your arms down to your side. Let your hips open the way that they need to. Slow down again. And I'll make this a little bit less traditional per se. If you want more focus, I'll give you three things. Okay. If you feel that your mind is everywhere, bring your hands down to the ground so you can ground yourself a bit better. If you feel that you're focused and calm and you just want to receive whatever there is to receive during this pose, palms of the hands upwards. If you want to focus on your breath, bring your right hand to your stomach, left hand to your heart, and just observe the flow of breath and the heartbeat. Same thing, about two minutes, enjoy. See if mentally you can let the hips calm down a little bit more so that the knees can go further towards the ground and the body and mind can open up. More than halfway there. Take one more inhale and one more exhale. Slowly use your hands to bring your knees all the way together. Take your time getting there. And then a nice counter pose here is to move the feet apart while keeping the knees together. Same thing, you can bring one hand to your stomach, the other hand to the heart or hands towards Namaste and thumbs to the middle of your forehead. Just a couple of breaths. And see how the body responds and also your mind. Observe, observe, observe. When you're ready to join me, we're going to do our last two poses, which are just supine twists. Let your knees come together and slowly move your knees over to the left side of your body. And again, if you want, you can put a block in between your legs or a, a kissin, oh my gosh, German in my mind, um, a pillow in between your knees. Okay, just a couple of moments here too, also close to two minutes. Let your arms go where they need. 
Feel free to look over to the other side. Stay with your breath and check in with where your mind is at. And slowly from here, begin to take one more inhale and one more exhale and then make your way all the way back towards center. And sit still for a moment. If you need to hug your knees into your chest, feel free to. Otherwise, see if you can stay completely still. Observe what you feel. Okay, our last side, slowly move your knees over to the right. Hips can go to the left. If you want the pillow or the block in between the knees, go for it. Or any other variations with your knees, please take. And enjoy. In about two minutes. there. From here, begin to take one more inhale. One more exhale, and 
then slowly begin to make your way all the way back towards center. And take a moment also to sit still. If you need to hug your knees into your chest this time, feel free to, or take any other positions. Okay, and then slowly from here, we find our way to Shavasana. So extend the legs forwards, arms out to the sides, eyes closed. Just a few moments of Shavasana. Enjoy. Relax the shoulders and the hips. Relax the feet and the hands. Relax the head, also what's inside. Find rest. slowly and carefully begin to bring some life back into the body and into the breath. Wiggle the fingers and wiggle the toes. And then roll over softly onto your right or your left side and stay there for a moment. Maybe make sure that you uh, hug yourself in some way, shape or form, some type of body contact. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. And then slowly find your way up towards a seated position with your eyes closed and your hands wherever you wish. So a nice meditative position. Hands can be on the knees. If you need to roll your neck and shoulders around, please do so now. And then sit still, eyes closed. And slowly from here, bring your hands to your heart, either in Namaste formation or bringing the hands to the heart, your choice. Take one big breath in for you and hold it. Keep your neck and shoulders relaxed. Slowly let it go. So as I always love to say, Namaste means that I bow to you and that the light in me honors and cherishes the light in each and every one of you or whoever came to this class today. So from my heart to yours, Namaste. Uh, so thank you for joining. I hope that you enjoyed this small uh, class for now. And before I send you off, just pretend that you are being virtually hugged. So please feel hugged. Thanks for joining. And hopefully here's to more videos. Take care for now.